Hello and welcome to our webinar on drying paper pulp with steam. In this webinar, we will go through the substantial benefits steam can provide on the bulk, absorption and strength, enabling you to maximize your profit and minimize your costs. My name is Manish Vermai and I work as the Business Development Manager here at Swedish Exergy. The company is based in Gothenburg, Sweden, or as we would call it on this side of the country, the best coast. To all of my Stockholm friends, you know it's true. No, I'll jokes, I'll jokes aside, uh, we invented the Super Steam Dryer in the late 70s at the Chalmers University. And the XT Super Steam Dryer is a closed loop indirect contact dryer, meaning that the heating media never comes in contact with the drying media. No. Swedish actually delivered its first dryer in 1979 to Rokhammerbruk, now a part of Billerud Koshnes. This dryer was in operation until 2016 and is still fully operable and used as a backup. However, since the demand for their product grew substantially, Rokama invested in a new Exesuper steam dryer with double the capacity. If we look at the pulp and paper market size worldwide, in 2019, the global paper and pulp market size was valued at circa 348 billion US dollars and is expected to grow to a value of almost 370 billion US dollars by 2027. Besides the increase in demand, the paper industry is a very large and broad industry with many applications such as commercial paper, packaging and hygiene products, where each application has its own requirements and demands. And while we are on the topic of requirements, our first client, Rokamas Brook, is a producer of liquid packaging and since their product is used in the food industry there's a high importance and value put on hygiene where the product has to be fully sterilized the product cannot emit any taste or smell nor can the product have any black spots there are many similarities in the pulp and paper production process the production process includes debarking chipping pulp production but depending on the end product use the refining process can vary and one of the most crucial and energy intensive process in the pulp and paper production is the drying and the method of drying has a significant impact on the quality of the end product the most common drying methods include drum dryers bell dryers hot air flash dryers all of which are direct contact dryers meaning that the heating media comes in contact with the product that is being dried inside and when you have a direct contact dryer with the drying media is air or gas, the product can be discolored or emit odor. It can even alter the taste of the product if used in liquid and food packaging. But what happens if we use steam as the drying media instead? Well, when the pulp is dried with steam, honification or oxidization does not occur. There is also substantial fiber expansion as well as no risk for contamination or discoloration. We are currently working with the Research Institute of Sweden, also known as RICE, testing various kinds of products for the pulp and paper industry. The tests will compare the changes characteristics of the product when dried using air-based dryers as compared to the Exesuper steam dryer. We have already conducted a pilot plant test on paper pulp derived from eucalyptus bark, which RICE have conducted a lab analysis on. And the preliminary results from these tests indicate a significant improvement when drying with steam. There is also a massive increase in bulk and tensile. The bulk increases by as much as 15%, which means that the absorption ability also increases greatly. And the tensile increases with 20%. Now these are a few of the benefits using steam versus air as the drying media. But there are more advantages using the XC Super steam dryer rather than a traditional type of dryer such as the net energy consumption is only 150 kilowatt hour for every ton of water that is evaporated. There is no fire or explosion risk, creating a safer environment for those working around it. And one of the biggest arguments made for the extra super steam dryer is that there is no air emission from the dryer itself. We at Swedish Exergy are constantly working towards the UN Sustainable Goals. By adopting the XA Super Steam Dryer, our clients can reduce their carbon footprint, they can reduce their water usage, reduce energy consumption, and reduce their production cost. All while they increase 
the production safety and reliability. And by introducing steam as the drying media in the production process, our clients can receive all the product enhancement properties that superheated steam provides. Now I really hope you found this webinar interesting and I thank you for taking the time to watch and listen. Please send us any questions or feedback you may have to sales at SwedishExergy.com or call me on the number listed on the screen. We look forward to hearing from you. Thank you once again and we'll see you next time.